All right, here we go. Another day, another lesson. So today, I am going to um, build a one product store on the theme booster. This is the theme booster video 2.0. Um, I'm going on one product store because that's the best product. Uh, excuse me, because because that's the best um, uh, method for drop shipping currently, and I think I found a product that is worth testing. So, got myself a logo. I went back to the beginning so you guys can see me come into it. And yeah, I'm just about to build this live here. You know, pretty quick. So let's get it. Come over to the header. Upload my logo. Toilet blaster. Save. All right. Um. Settings. So let me see. Take size. I don't. Let me see. I want to say. I want to say that. This don't yeah that doesn't fit well. Let me see. We're gonna adjust the size of this. Doesn't matter. That doesn't look good, so we're going to remove this. We're going to remove that. Let me see how this looks. Boom. This looks right here. Okay. So whenever you adjust, uh, whenever you adjust the header, make sure you adjust it on both mobile. And desktop header. Center see desktop logo and mobile. Put it on there for mobile. This is how you check mobile to see what it looks like. Alright, that looks good. All right. So um let me see. Let me come back here. Oh yeah, so in a theme booster, on this side, this is where you're able to put in more images if you want. So let's say I wanted to add an image right here. Oh, wait for them to come up like this. Oh. All right, save it. back over this is how you make it live make whatever part live and then I'm able to adjust where I want it All right and then you can do this with anything All right so let's say I want to put testimonials in here select it obviously upload the image of the person who gave you the testimony and type in their testimony right do that for all of them and then you're able to adjust up you know click and put it in there for all of them all right select the image and write the review right here and then put the reviewers name right here you're able to add as many testimonies as you want to all right and then you can slide it anywhere you want to which is super cool and super important because having testimonials is uh, social proof but we'll get into that in a second if you, if you want to have a newsletter same thing if you want to have a pop out you can install your Instagram account right here put the access token in there 
this shows you how many uh, images and rows from your Instagram feed to be on there and then uncheck that and then you can adjust it anywhere you want to also you can come in here to add section you can put in your blog post different products when it says collection these are collect like collection lists of your products uh, dividers pictures pictures with images pictures with images over the uh, pictures with text over the image your logo and slideshows featured products info badges that looks interesting for shipping over I may or may not use that I don't know we'll look and see how it looks at the end for people who have physical locations you could put your uh, you could put your map on there you know frequently asked questions timer settings we're not gonna go into that oh, oh yeah so look countdown timers so countdown timers um, adds urgency and scarcity so remember um, I'm not sure if I mentioned this in any previous videos but we have these um, pages set up we use these themes the way we excuse me we use these themes because they have all of the um, cognitive biases tactics built into the themes already so different urgency and scarcity and loyalty and trust tactics already built in um, and all these biases influence someone to make a decision quicker um, so there's a book called the 25 cognitive biases I encourage you guys to read it it's a book on on human psychology on why we make the decisions that we do and it's based on the 25 cognitive biases right and the more biases that you have in one direction the more likely someone is to make a decision you, you're able to upload YouTube videos here also so let's say I wanted to upload one of my videos, one of my course videos. I put the title right here. I will put the um, the embedded link. So, like I said, I wanted to put this Acon video on right here, right? I've been looking. Don't judge. I've been looking up some uh, some uh, stuff you were saying about Africa. So, but let's say I want to put that in there just for the sake of showing you guys. I'm not going to leave it in here. Just for the sake of showing you guys. Boom. Right, Acon, Acon is awesome. Right, safe. Oh, come on. Wait for it to save. Wait, hang on. We'll come. We'll bring it back. We'll bring it back. We'll bring it back. Share. Oh, my mistake. That's why. Got to put the iframe link. Uh, silly me. Only putting a YouTube link. You got to take the i the um the iframe code and put it in there. Boom. Save. That should work. Just for the sake of showing you guys, but I'm still going to build this out. What the fuck? Name of video. Alright, well, normally that's how you do it. I don't know why this isn't working. Yeah, but typically that's how you do it. We're, we're going to move forward. And shop is how you do it as well. You just take the iframe code and just put it in there. Yeah, but we're about to continue. Not gonna spend a lot of time on that. Alright. Yeah, I just want people to see what you're able to do. We're gonna hide that though. Um alright, so image with text. I'm gonna say something funny like you no longer have to use 
a plunger like a caveman in 2020 to fix <laughs> your clog. I'm not a good speller. Toilet. The toilet blaster. Two point is here to save the day. What I'm doing this video. Oh, we should be fine. It's with text. Don't use oh, well no. I'm not gonna say that. Let's let's just keep it simple and say toilet blaster. 2.0 is here to save the day. Mm. Alright, nice, nice, nice. Okay. Uh, we're going to put the collection right here. I don't necessarily want a collection because it's about to be a one product store. So, let's come back here. And you guys are in for a treat. So, for people that are building a brand um, for themselves, or, you know, using these videos to get your website together, it's definitely dope. And for people who do not have a, uh, a product that they're selling and is looking to create a brand, also pay attention because I'm about to give everybody a gem, a great gem, that both someone who's not using, uh, who doesn't have an established brand can use, and someone who also has an established brand can use. Can use. Apps. Zendrop. So... Uh, for the last however many years drop shipping has been around people have been using AliExpress and Orbelo to import products in to their store and then run ads to them and get a bunch of sales it's a lot of people who are literally millionaires off of this business model with the coronavirus basically fucking up the global supply chain the products that are shipped over from China are, are taking like two or three months to uh, fulfill and get to your customer and customers do not like that no one wants to wait two months for an item that they ordered right so Zendrop has all the same products for a cheaper price and better shipping uh, and better shipping times and damn near all these products that um, are put on that are put on this platform are already winners so this right here is is a nug is, is is a golden gem. I know for a fact no one is teaching this currently for free. That Zendrop is available. So yeah, I just want to put you guys hip. If you guys decide to try to steal my product, steal my store, good luck. Got to outmarket me. But figure for the sake of teaching people. Do the right thing. All right. So this is this is my toilet blaster. I'm gonna import this to the store. Very nice. Okay. Also apps. I'm gonna add theme booster.
Alright. We definitely want the trust badges. Let me make sure. Let me see something real quick. I'm going to double check. Let me double check the store. Actually, let me upload this product. Let's import it again. So, always try to brand your products just because brands do better. I'm going to spend the toilet this whole time. Toilet wrong this whole time. Toilet blaster. 2.0. We're going to go over how to create a beautiful product description page in a little while. Probably want this picture first. Let's move this. Let's move that. Let's move this. Let's move that. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Let's move this up here. Yeah, come on. There we go. That looks good. All right, we'll adjust this in a little bit. This is for the sake of getting this on the page. All right, okay. All right, collections. Go back here. Let's see how we're looking. Normally, I like to try to build on the on uh, the mobile part because more people are going to land to your store from mobile. I think I want the the centered. I think I want my header centered. Um, move with text. Oh, it didn't save any of our changes. That's what happened. <laughs> All right. So for this one product store, for the most part, oh no, we're, we're on a debut thing. That's why. <laughs> My mistake, guys. Theme booster. All right. Collection list. We're gonna try that. Add selections. Featured collection. What about products? Featured product. Add. Select a product. Toilet blaster. Boom. Safe. Boom. And just slot this up. Yeah, this is really the important part when it comes to this thing. Because you guys definitely need to know how to add everything on, take everything off. Right? So, all, all of this shit, I don't need it. I might make a slot show of all the products. I might do that. Um, I don't need this. And I don't need this. Maybe I do a slideshow, maybe I don't, I don't know. Alright, looks nice. We gotta fix this product page, but let's come along. Alright, let's save it. Theme settings, colors, you wanna keep everything. You wanna keep everything, typically two to three colors, the same colors as your logo. It's typically what you want. 
you want to keep the cell pri um let me see you want to keep the uh the add to cart buttons and the shop buttons green or red for the most part Wonder what special buttons they could be talking about. I intend to sell in multiple countries so I'm turning on the currency conversion and you know I'm teaching you guys how to run ads in multiple different countries so you know you want you want uh, wh whoever your traffic comes from no matter what country you want them to be able to purchase in their currency so I'm turning on the currency conversion because I plan to run I plan to run worldwide ads discount pop-ups I'm gonna disable this pop-up for right now Um, and guys, only way to really learn anything is to go through and click every single button and double check and make sure everything is the way you want it. You know, I can show you these videos, you know, but ultimately it boils down to you 
like ultimately just putting in the work and just grinding it out. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, we're rolling. Yeah, I'm doing the work with no excuses. It's not hard, it's just time consuming. It's not difficult, it's just tedious. I'm just checking over everything, dotting all my I's, crossing my T's. Okay. So everything that I'm checking off is is all the different biases. So let you guys know. Boom, boom. Check up page. Very important. Here. Sections. Put this above here. Boom. Move this back down here. Boom. Alright. Okay. It's coming along. Now this is a simple one product store. Let me see. It looks like a great deal. 50% off plus free shipping when you purchase two or more. Increase my order value. No. I think I want to add an upsell in here. Direct to cart, direct to checkout. I like to have people go directly to the checkout. Uh, 
Oh, it was an image. One hour is not for this. Definitely one hour is for this. Dad just definitely want those. Oh, we gotta upload them. That's fine. That's what I'm gonna add the. That's what I'm gonna add the theme booster for. But it's cool they have it built in. All right, nice. Save that. Yeah. Um, okay. Settings. Cool. You got a few different ways that you can hook this up to. You can definitely change the style of. You can definitely change the style up on this. The colors are probably different though. Because you guys saw that color change immediately, huh? I saw it change. I'm just playing around with it. I encourage you guys to do the same thing. Oh man, this keep changing the colors up. Ah, uh, whatever. Oh, fuck it, we'll just come back. Save. Um. Look at it from all angles. Okay. Oh, this is in the collection of footer. Crazy, no, not crazy stir. <laughs> I did horrible on all my spelling tests in school. Funny, funny, fun fact.
the most efficient. Spell check. Efficient way to fix the claw. No more using a plunger by the caveman. Beautiful. It's looking good, folks. Looking good, folks. And trust me, this right here will work for the most simple, you know. If you're looking for something simple and easy and fast to set up, this is it. You know, this is how you do it. I oh, don't know why that came up. No, you guys can see some of the some of the tactics I mentioned earlier, like the countdown timer, only eleven left. Fifteen people are viewing this currently. Estimated delivery time fourteen to thirty days. Now I'm pretty sure my shipping time is going to be better than this, but you guys see the tactics. There's obviously nobody on this page. No one's looking at this. I have thousands of these in stock. You know what I mean? These to get people to act more impulsively. You know. Same thing with the countdown timer. But I might want to, the countdown timer, I might want to fix the time on that. I might, I might, 11 hours might be too long. Mm. Product page, add to cart message. I like direct to checkout, personally. What's my delivery time over here? Thank you. Let's see. Eight to fifteen days. Awesome. Because from China, this is going to take 30 to 60 days, easily. This is why we use Zendrop. Slightly more expensive, but it, trust me, it's worth it to have faster shipping. You know, keeps your customers happy. Let's go back. Say 14, 20 more days. No, we'll say 7. What did they say? 8 to 15, we'll say 7 to 25, 7 to 14. That should be fine. Takes an extra day. I'll just email them and communicate with them. Save. Okay. Enable red more button. And go back. Up sales. Now this right here is a beautiful thing about this thing, the upsells. Now, back in the day, and before we had this app, we used to have to pay for upsell apps like seventy to a hundred dollars a month. Because you see, one more, one more of these, I make an extra eighty bucks, right? And you know, good drop shippers. Even like like semi weak drop ship shippers like do fifteen to twenty orders a day, you know what I mean? So let me remove this. Oh shoot! Let me see. Add quantum product upsell. 
select product, boom. Oh, fuck it, we'll do it two times. Boom. All right. So now, when someone goes to buy this and they check out, oh, wait, but buy another one. You guys should probably see this in action. Buy it now. Oh, that does not look good. So we're going to have to fix this. I don't like the background of this. Let me see this. this product page timer. Let's go back here. I don't like the way that looks. As we upload more products, I'll say, you know, we'll get that on there. Oh no, we don't want that. I actually want like a other red. Yeah, I want to go red. You want to go red on your buy now buttons. Trust me. Maybe we had it right with the orange. Buttons, I don't necessarily like that though. the way blue looks in there either I don't like the way gray looks in here the gray looks better on there. Hmm. we're gonna have to figure that out Main content area, that's probably where we can remove this. And then the order summary, move. Alright, let's see if that makes a. Hit save, and let's see if that makes a difference. And our checkout page. That definitely looks a little bit cleaner. Definitely looks cleaner. Cool. Definitely looks cleaner. All right, nice. All right. So the next part, I'm gonna teach you guys. Uh, also, you guys are gonna want to publish your theme. Publish it to make it to, to make it the, th the main theme. Right. 
motorcycle like another look at this now obviously obviously I'm gonna, I'm gonna fix the product description page up make it look a lot nicer and I'm gonna do a separate video for the product description page but I just wanted to quickly get this built uh, I think I'm gonna get rid of this slot shelf right now we're just gonna keep this more simple remove section we're gonna keep that more simple image with text image with text right here oh we got it we got another one right here. so I want to get rid of this too remove content boom Yeah, boom. Nice toilet blaster. Very simple one. Product store. Someone come here. Oh, great. A sweet plunger. And they can just buy. And that's all we want. You know? Alright. So, the next video, I'm going to do product description page. And then we're going to run some ads. And see how they, See how it goes. Thank you guys for watching. Actually, we're not done yet. <laughs> I'm gonna do a separate video showing this, but I'm, you know, I'm, I'm gonna put this on live while while we're here, while I'm thinking about it. So, folks, I use Privy as my email marketing and tech subscribers. People will tell you to use Clavio and Mailchimp and other ways which are all great platforms I say do what works for you and for me this is work this has helped me generate hundreds of thousands of dollars for my clients so I'm gonna add this on install app and yeah setting up privy that's gonna be another separate video too Properly setting up your email sequence and your text marketing sequence. Grab and go. Confirm. I just want to do a quick look at this to make sure I am satisfied with the little work that I've done here in the last hour or so. So look, look, see it popping up? Boom. Someone purchased the toilet blaster right 15 people viewing the toilet blaster now the product description page still isn't set up as badass as we would like and it will be so don't you guys worry about that but yeah the fundamentals are there the fundamentals are there buy it now the fundamentals are definitely there folks oh yeah <laughs> I gotta put my card on file for you guys to see that so I'm going to wrap this video up. I gave a lot of gems. Zendrop. No, nobody has taught anything about Zendrop yet. We are moving away from AliExpress drop shipping. And I repeat, we are moving away from AliExpress drop shipping. Um, people who taught me this are multi-millionaires. There's multiple people that are millionaires doing this. So please trust what I'm telling you. And, uh, you know, thank you guys for... Well, actually, hang on. I might as well see if Toilet Blaster. <laughs> I keep getting caught up. All right, all right, you guys. See you guys in the next video.